Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a really festive look for you guys. This is just like my go-to every year for Christmas. I really, really love the red lipstick. I did a full tutorial, face and eyes, everything for you guys. So if you guys want to see how I did this look, then keep on watching. I've already moisturized my face and I'm using the Glam Glow um, Vocasmic Glow Matte Moisturizer, Matte Glow Moisturizer. It's so good. I know I've talked about it before, but I'm going to be using a new primer today since it's been really, really dry, you guys, out here in LA. This is from Herborean Korean Skin Therapy. It is such a good moisturizer. It's not drying whatsoever. I've tried it once before, um, not on camera though. But it was kind of like one of those no makeup makeup days and it was just really really nice we are going to start with face first so i'm going to be mixing these two together just because i feel like this one the charlotte tilbury magic foundation this one is in shade seven um this one is great um it's kind of like a semi matte finish it's really really nice but i feel like i want a little bit more coverage and i'm gonna go in with my infallible this one is in shade 107 uh, you guys know I really like this one for like more full coverage, but I'm trying, trying you guys to use other foundations. So I'm just going to be mixing them in the back of my hand. Coming in with my beauty blender and I'm just going to be pouncing this and blending it all in. For concealer, I'm going to be using my um, Makeup Forever Ultra HD Concealer in Y31. You guys, I feel like this... Um, this month I know that everyone says they gain a lot of weight during the month of December right because of the holidays and like family comes over and everyone just starts eating and you know all of that but I've never felt like I was actually gaining weight in the month of December more than I do like any other month um but this year I feel like this December I've already gained like 15 pounds and it's only like the beginning of December I mean we're heading towards mid but I'm not kidding you guys. I feel like I just can't stop eating. It's horrible. It's horrible. And I'm also a stress eater. Um, you know, which is not ideal. It's not the best, but I can't help it sometimes. And when I'm stressed out, I just like begin to eat. And then you add in the time of the month, you know, and then you're just you're just you've just gained so much weight um for my face i'm gonna be using my airspun oh my god and you know with that feeling where it's like you know you have to lose weight because you're feeling sluggish every time and you're like it's because i keep eating yeah well that's that's where i'm at i'm just like can i just lose weight but then i start thinking well it's not you know it's tamale season so i'm just like it's not christmas yet just just wait for the new year wait till new year's is over and then new year new me <laughs> you guys i've been saying that for fucking years um coming in with my studio fix powder and my morphe e31 and i'm just going to first kind of stipple on the powder and then circular motions to remove the air spun Coming in with my uh, Bare Minerals Bare Pro Contour Kit in Tan to Dark. I'm going to take the middle shade and I'm just going to start warming up my face. Not contouring at all. It's kind of like just a bronzer. Just adding some more warmth back into my face. And we definitely need to contour today because I know that my face... And this is the thing, it's like when I do gain weight, it's like it goes straight to my face. And like, why can't I go anywhere else? Like my butt or something. <laughs> you guys, I can't be the only one who thinks that. I can't. For blush, I'm going to be mixing these two right here and this one. And they're both from Tarte. This one is Exposed and this one is Party. Um, obviously, there's a big size difference. This one was the one that I got from this like little travel size mini. I received this one from um, my Sephora birthday club thing. Um, yeah, so first I'm going to go in with my Exposed, which is a favorite of mine. And I'm using an It Cosmetics French Boutique Blush Brush. And then I'm going to use Party. Same place. Just adding a little bit more like a rosy pink. 
Okay, so for highlighter, let's just finish off with the highlighter and then we'll move on to the eyes. I'm going to be using this little palette right here and this is from Laura Geller. I recently received a package from them, which by the way was like life changing. It was amazing. I opened it on Snapchat and I could not believe that I received something from Laura Geller. So thank you so much. Um, I'm going to be using this little trio right here. And this one has French Fizz, Pixie Pearl, and Molten Copper. So I'm going to probably be using a mix of French Fizz and Molten Copper for this look. So I haven't really tried any of these. Like I've swatched them, but like I haven't actually applied them. So I'm going to be using my um, Thrive Cosmetics blush. I'm sorry, highlighter brush. And I mean, how cool do these look, you guys? Can you guys see that? So cool. For today's look, I'm going to be using my Morphe and Jaclyn Hill palettes. I love this palette so much. I feel like I'm going to be using this throughout the month, like, to do actual, um, like, different Christmas looks. I really want to do something with, like, these greens down here. Um, but today we're going to be focusing more on this area of the palette. So let's get started. Also, as you guys can tell, I did end up taping the names here so that I can explain to you guys what you know which colors I'm using um first off I'm going to use my Morphe M504 and I'm gonna be coming in with this color right here this is creamsicle this one right there and by the way I did already prime my eyes and I've set them as well with powder all oh, this palette these colors blend so nicely now using the shade right next to it which is butter using the same brush I'm just not going to blend it so high this time. Now using my Morphe M503, I'm going to be mixing a little bit of Pooter and Bunts together. You guys already know I have to cut my crease. It just makes my eyes look a lot bigger and it gives me more lip space to add a really nice shimmer. So that's what I'm going to do. Using my Morphe E14, I'm going to be using Queen, which is this beautiful, beautiful gold shimmer, and that's going to go all over my lid. Using my Morphe M507, I'm going to be using the shade Soda Pop. Then coming in with one of my favorite colors, this is Hunt's, and I'm just going to be using this between Queen and Soda Pop. To make this look a little bit more festive, I'm going to be using my Urban Decay Heavy Metal in Midnight Cowboy. And that's going to go right above my crease. And I really want to make this like a thick line. I don't want to make it too thin because when I open my eyes, I still want you to be able to see the glitter. Now taking buns and chip mixed together. Lastly, we're taking hunts and adding some more of that red. For my lashes, I'm going to be using, am I even focused? Oh, Lord. Um, I'm going to be using my, this is a Pure Cosmetics box for lashes but actually you guys you guys know my favorite lashes from pure they broke or they ripped so yeah um i'm gonna be using my queen bee from coco lashes these are also a favorite of mine for lips i'm gonna be using this jordana lip liner in toast and then i'm also going to be using this smashbox Always on liquid lipstick in Bang Bang. I think the, that's the name. Wait, is this like an orange or is this a red? I think this will do. It's like a red orange. By the way, you guys, I could not find like a true red in my lipstick collection. Like I'm still thinking like I know I have some. But, like where the hell do they go? I don't know. This color is so pretty, but it's not red. I think I'm going to use another lipstick over this. All right, guys, so this is my finished look. I ended up adding some of this Makeup Forever um, liquid lipstick in 403. It is the perfect shade. I actually should have gone in with this one, but I had to just dig up and see what red I actually had. Um, yeah, but this was a really good one, plus the formula. You guys already know, this is my favorite liquid lipstick formula. But this is the finished look. I actually really, really love how this turned out. It just gives me so much, like, 
Christmas vibes and holiday vibes and hopefully this gave you guys some inspiration or some ideas to incorporate into your Christmas day look and if you guys did enjoy it make sure you guys give this video a big thumbs up I love you guys subscribe and I will see you in my next one bye